All right, we're gonna keep it as quick and simple as possible. This is a really simple trick within OBS that I wanna show you. So you can make your recordings for YouTube if you are recording through OBS for YouTube a little bit more crisp in regards to quality. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, German Luke. If we have not met before, my name is Luke, streamer on Twitch, as well as on YouTube, but all the links are down in the description below. I don't really wanna waste a lot of time with the introduction of the video and jump straight in. Here's a little bit of information that you need in order to understand why I encountered this problem. As some of you already know, I'm using the Sony A5100 for my Twitch streams, as well as for the YouTube video that you're watching right now. And if you're wondering if that is a good camera in 2020, I did make a video about it and I will link it in the card up here. But that is not the topic of the video today. That being said, I also record my YouTube videos through OBS since that's how the camera is set up already. And that's where I encountered the problem. When I watched the video on YouTube afterwards, I saw that the quality was absolute. No, God! No, God, please, no, no! 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 Just bad. It was just bad. And for a camera like the Sony A5100, it should have been better. And I was wondering what I was doing wrong. I looked all over the internet. I could not find an answer to my OBS settings that might have been off. So big shout out to the Stream Elements Discord server and the people within that server that helped me figure out the problem that I had. And here's what it was. The trick was so stupid and so simple that I figured I will make a really quick video about it. Because like I said, I couldn't find it. And here's where the problem was. Within the output settings of recording, I was using the wrong settings. What I was not taking into consideration is that each camera has its own constant bitrate CBR of which the camera is recording. So when I record a video with the camera, but through OBS, in my recordings, I need to match those settings. For the Sony A5100, the speed is 50 megabytes per second or 50,000 KBS. So in my OBS recordings, I was not matching that. I actually had 15,000 in there because for streaming, we all know Twitch caps it at 6,000. When I record gameplay, I usually use 15,000 just for the heck of it to make it HD, but I wasn't going anywhere beyond that. That being said, I recorded my YouTube video and already compressed the quality because I was recording in too low of a CBR. If you're using a DSLR as your Twitch camera and as well for your YouTube videos and you are recording through OBS, Make sure you match your bitrate within the recording settings of OBS with your camera. And some of you might already been shaking your heads and banging your heads against the wall. How did he not know to do that? Well, let me take it one step further. We are now in Premiere Pro and this is the software that I edit my videos with. And I was recording the video in a lower quality and then exporting it in an even lower quality. I know, this is what I used to do. I went down to the YouTube Full HD settings down below and did not change the bitrate settings within Premiere Pro. So again, here you need to match the quality of the camera. So you go to CBR and you then type in, this is in megabits per second, not in kilobits compared to OBS. And you simply type in 50 megabytes and you export it. So what you're doing now is you're using the camera's quality that it was intended to use or recording your YouTube videos and you're now exporting it in the same quality, meaning along the way you're using very little to none quality of the actual video. And this was basically my really stupid but big mistake. I recorded the video in a low quality, meaning I compressed the video simply by recording it. I compressed it even further by exporting it in the wrong settings and then I upload it to YouTube. And as we all know, YouTube compresses the video once again to make it just a smaller and easier file for YouTube to manage. That being said, I compressed my video three times, which was just completely lost and wasted quality. And I don't want you to make that same mistake. So check your camera settings, what CBR is the camera recording in, match it in your OBS, match it in your export setting of whatever video editing device that you're using and then upload it to YouTube and your quality will increase significantly. And that was it guys. If I missed anything, I do stream every Monday, Wednesday and Friday over on Twitch. Hit down in the description below. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Make sure you share the video with your friends and family. If you really liked it, hit the subscribe button with the bell. It would really mean the world to me. Helps out the video game spread even further. Stay hydrated. I'll catch you next time.